Caroline Manzo has officially sued Bravo. According to court documents, the Real Housewives of New Jersey alum filed a lawsuit against the network and numerous other production companies for an alleged interaction between herself and Brandy Glanville while filming a season of Real Housewives Ultimate Girls Trip in Morocco. Per the legal papers, Manzo has sued for negligence, sexual harassment, as gender discrimination, sexual battery and other causes of action that she says violate state laws in CA and NY. In the documents, the 62-year-old claimed that on the night of January 24, 2023, she and her fellow cast members were at a bar watching a snake handler perform when things took a turn between the two reality stars. Clearly intoxicated, Glanville walked over to Manzo, spread Manzo's legs and leaned into Manzo, she claimed. Glanville proceeded to kiss Manzo with a closed mouth. Glanville then kissed Manzo again. Manzo was very uncomfortable. Glanville then proceeded to mount Manzo on the couch holding Manzo down with her body, forcibly squeezed Manzo's cheeks together and thrust her tongue in Manzo's mouth while humping her. After Manzo was able to get away, she went into a nearby bathroom where she could compose herself from the traumatic experience. As Manzo stood at the sink washing her hands, Glanville entered the bathroom and came behind Manzo, forced her V against Manzo's buttocks, V against Manzo's back, wrapped her long arms around Manzo forcibly restraining her and began washing her hands with Manzo's hands entwined, the documents alleged. Immediately, Manzo tried to exit the bathroom. The bathroom door was locked. Glanville pinned Manzo's body against the door. Glanville pressed her V and V against Manzo. Glanville then reached around Manzo's body and then groped, grabbed, and forcibly fondled Manzo's V and V. At the same time, Glanville pushed her face into Manzo's neck in order to kiss her. From inside the bathroom, Manzo cried, help, 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 but no one ever came. According to the former reality star, the crew continued filming her throughout even though she was in distress from the sexual assaults, according to the lawsuit. Two staffers told Manzo that Glanville's behavior was just her way of showing love. Defendants continued to film Manzo and video record her experiences in order to profit from the entertainment of Manzo's sexual assault experience, Manzo's legal team claimed in the suit. Bravo has yet to respond to the lawsuit. TMZ obtained the court documents.